Hey guys, today I'm going to show you how to fix this offset you get when you're trying to mirror a sub tool. Okay, so here I'm going to ZBrush, and as you can see, this is just one mesh. So, what we want to do is we want to uh, mirror this sculpted hand to that side. Okay, so what will we do first is we we'll hit X to activate symmetry, and then if you're getting an offset, we have to switch on local symmetry. Okay, so once that's done, you'll make the brush size low, and then after that, you'll mask just the center of it, the exact center of the sub okay just that little and then what you can do is go down to uh, polygroups and then you go to group mask and then you group mask again what will this will do is it will group just this mask pass 3d okay so now we select this mesh and hide the others we can do this by holding control shift and then click okay there we go and now we want to set the symmetry here the new symmetry point will be here in the center so let's go to uh... let me see where is it okay yeah, it's it. we go to transform and then we click this set pivot point to create a new pivot point so we go ahead and select that okay once that's done you can hold control shift and then click to bring all the stuff back and then you can unmask that once that's done now we need to group our mesh so that we can split it and mirror this the other side okay so what we will do here is uh, we will first polygroup all the meshes using X symmetry okay there you go I got it enabled so what I will do is mask the areas I wanted to be a uh, polygrouped okay so group mast and group mast okay so now you can see that I have different polygroups and now I'll go ahead and only s select the arms so I can view them and now I'll switch off axiometry and then I'll mask one arm can mask any one arm okay and then we can go in group mask set again so now these two are different groups let's bring all our groups back our mesh back unmask everything okay that's that and now we want to actually split all our groups into different meshes into different sub tools so what we'll do is hold control shift and click on one mesh you go to split and split hidden and we repeat the process again we select one mesh and then we can go to split hidden there we go now we have our meshes ready so now uh we can go ahead and hide the the hand that needs to be replaced that needs we'll remove it whenever well I'll just go ahead and delete because it's no more no it's no longer needed anyways hit ok ok so now what we'll do is uh, select the arm and then after that we go to trans wait uh, actually z plugins you go to z plugins and search for sub tool master 
we'll open the sub tool master and then we we'll select the tool that you want to mirror and we'll go he go ahead and hit mirror so here is it's showing where you want to in which axis you want to mirror the sub tool and always leave this check because this is mer merging it into one sub tool will cause problems up to you just need to append it as a new sub tool and later on merge it so we'll go hit go ahead and hit okay okay so now what you can do is as you can see it mirrored perfectly and it never come out as this if you never get any offset okay so there we go we fixed that problem now we want to join all of them so what we can do is we select the first mesh the first sub tool and go to merge and then hit merge down and click ok and now do that again and done ok now you can see these gaps here a little what you need to do is uh, go to geometry go to dynamesh and set the resolution according to the details you have well mine's pretty high well okay and then you can go ahead and activate dynamesh as you can see it's processing well dynamesh will well all of those gaps for us and you just have to go in there and smooth it okay so here we go so now we can just go ahead and smooth uh, make the brush size a little large hold shift and smooth and smooth and smooth and smooth all of this as well and as you can see now we have just got the other sculpt mirrored without any offset or anything thanks for viewing this and if you have any problems don't forget to leave comments and please subscribe thank you